<laughs> hey beautiful people, this is Chipper Sarah Zai and welcome to my vlog. I'm at the spa, on the spa floor. Just had my nails done in a nice cute neutral color. Uh, getting ready for the USA. It's like seven or so days till the USA. I'm excited. I finished making the wedding dress. Um, I'll show you pictures of it. It's been so much hard work, so I think I kind of deserve going to the spa. So um, I'll, see, I'll show you guys some pictures, and yeah, I'll be posting. Hi again. I just had my massage and my pedicure as well. It is amazing. Oh, I can't turn the camera around. I'll just have to show my feet. I hope you can see them. They look so pretty, wiggly toes. And I've had like a foot massagey thing. This place is really beautiful. I really like it. <laughs> I've got a circle from the massage bed. It looks lovely. But yeah, I'm so relaxed. I like my nude nail. Mm, I showed those to you before. So, the massage was amazing. I didn't realize how many knots I had in my shoulders and in my back. It's like crazy. Um, now I know where to tell my husband to work on, like just below my shoulders here. It's pretty cool. But yeah, it's really, really good. It's been lovely. I feel relaxed. And now I can't wait to go to the hot tub and to the sauna. It's gonna be fantastic. Uh, I think I'll go to the steam room as well. I think it'll be awesome. But yeah, I can't wait now. I'm excited. And now we're done with the spa. And we're in the drop top, baby. Going to get some food, something to eat, some grub. Say hi, Lainey. Say hi. <laughs> yes, that's correct. So yes, I'm going to get food. My nose is looking wider. I don't know why. Bye. I was doing too much close-up. Lolita's on the wheel. And we're off. In the drop top. In the drop top. Turn right on to Derby Road, A608, and continue straight Having to Having a fabulous Derby day. Road. Hey beautiful people, um, today is day, I think day five in the countdown, till the USA. Um, yeah, this is my very not neat pile of clothes that I started selecting and I'm just still sorting them out. Um, I don't know what I'm going to need workout clothes for, but you never know. Somebody may be like, hey, let's go to the gym. So yeah, I've also got, um an LRD instead of an LBD instead of a little black dress I've got a little red dress I um, made this for myself uh, when I was going out for a meetup with some ladies from my daughter's school and yeah I just wanted a plain dress that is just comfortable and I think it's a very holiday one because it travels really well as you can see it's hardly got any creases on it so yeah, I'm going to be having that and a couple of pair of jeans as well. So, yes, we've started packing. I'm actually being organized in terms of traveling. Usually I pack the day before or something, but I've noticed that it's quite stressful, so I'm not doing that. Um, I got this uh, from Primark, just a nice hoodie. This I'll probably travel in because it's handy for uh, so that I don't have to hold my passport in my hands and so on. And I'll just... Wear my hoodie and be comfortable. But yeah, the packing process has begun. Shoes. Oh boy. I don't know what I'm going to do with shoes. I'll have to see. I would really like a green pair of shoes and I'll tell you why. Hey beautiful people. It's day four. I think. Um, four or three, four. Okay. Today's the Thursday before. So yeah. Um, I don't have an outfit. This is it. And I <laughs> sketched it on a random envelope. I don't know if you can make out that. That's a cigarette pant or trousers, depending on where you come from. And this is a high-low uh, peplum top slash skirt. So I can wear it, like, say, on a date night, really short. Uh, obviously, it won't be appropriate for church if I was to wear it. So I would want to wear a cigarette pant. I haven't decided uh, whether to have a black cigarette pant a green one or an orange one because I've got a lot of colors to work with likewise with um, the fascinator I don't know whether to make it green or orange 
um, black probably won't be that nice at a wedding. Um, the shoes. Okay, I found these shoes from New Look. And I found some at my lovely favorite outlet that sells um, X Marks and Spencer stuff um, locally in Derby. And the shoe matches this exactly. But they only had a size 4 and a size 6. And I'm a size 5, which is really frustrating. Which is like a USA, I think, size 7. Um, so I couldn't get the shoe that I wanted. I'm going to see if I can go into town with my sister today. So I'll vlog again later. But yeah. Um, I got a couple of hours to make an outfit, so let me make it happen. Bye. Hey, people. Yeah, so this is the current situation. I'm about to do my hair. This is the before, and then I'll show you the after afterwards. I put one pass of straighteners in my hair so that it can be more manageable, and then I can plait it. I'm planning on doing a mohawk hairstyle. Because, um, yeah, I don't like too much crochet in my head. So I compensate that by putting corn, uh, cornrow on the side so that it's not too bushy. Um, sorry about the lighting. I know it's really rubbish, but hey, work with me. It's just my phone. Yeah, this is what we're doing today. So, yeah, I hope you're going to like the hair stuff. Well, as long as I like it. <laughs> Love you guys. <laughs> I'll show you the result later. Today is, um, I think, day four or something before USA. Day four, three, wait, Saturday, Sunday, Monday. Yeah, somewhere around there. But yeah, I'm doing here today. Thanks. Hey beautiful people, it's Chippa Sarazai and welcome to my vlog. Can you see me? I am barefaced today. Ah, but my skin looks alright if I must say so myself. I am by oh gosh, I've forgotten the name of the place. Babe. Panon I am by Cassington. Cassington Water or Cassington Water. I'm not sure how to pronounce it. And we're now going for a gorgeous walk. If you can, you can just see the lake in the back down there. And there's a lot of lakes actually. I think there's about two or three. And there's boats and everything. Um, yeah, um, it's three days until the USA. Yay! So we've just come here for a family day out. Spend time with the kids and everything. And Habay. It's been lovely. It's so beautiful. Um, we've come around with loads of our friends. And there's the lake and everything. It looks amazing. So. In terms of my progress in getting ready for the USA, I've done my hair. I did it last night. I don't know if you can see it, just about. It's a mohawk style, which is what I prefer because it gets a bit heavy sometimes if it's my whole head with crochet. But yeah, so far so good. Hardly any packing done, but hopefully we'll get there soon. But yeah, I'll get back to you later. Bye. Oh. Don't forget to subscribe. Please share and please subscribe. I'm really tired, so I'm not really thinking straight. I'm sorry. <laughs> but yeah, you mo don't forget your most beautiful being you. Bye. In one day left until USA, I'm flying out tomorrow morning and we're having Nando's. Yum, yum, yum. So yeah, I'm flying out tomorrow and I'm really excited and I haven't finished packing. The joy is off. But I'm spending time with the family and we're having a meal and I need to get off my phone now so I can enjoy it. Bye! Hey people! Oh, you can't really see. So yeah, we've just eaten and now i um, going to finish packing because I've not finished packing. And the kids are very full of beans and they've eaten. And my best friend is laughing. She's happy. <laughs> So yeah, we're about to go back to the car now if we can find it. And yeah, I'm gonna finish packing and then tomorrow we'll be up. I'm so full. Thank you, Nando's. Hey beautiful people. I finally finished my dress. It's in the living room amongst piles of clothes. But yeah, it looks quite um I don't know. Wakanda. <laughs> I've done a high-low hemline. 
um, and it's got a little tutu underskirt. I'll show you when I put it on. But yeah, it was fun to make. I made it while my best friend was here. Um, and she sort of was like helping me out before um, we went out for dinner later. And uh, no, I've not finished packing. I'm about to. 10 to midnight. Talk about last night. Daddy will be here in eight hours to pick us up to go to the airport. So, yeah. My sister kindly loaned me this gorgeous fascinator. And I popped some of the fabric through. And I'll finish it off when I'm in the US. I'm wearing some cigarette pants under the dress. And I'm gonna put some buttons that are coated in that fabric. So, I'm looking forward to showing you guys. Hey beautiful people, it's the day of traveling to USA. Our bus has just arrived. My mom and I are about to get on it now um, and head over to the airport. I got my mocha because I can't handle coffee, so yeah. See you guys later. Hey people, I'm now at the airport with my mommy and we're munching away at fruit before we go to security, which we heard can be pretty long. Um, yeah, it's been hectic packing and weighing our bags. We actually did well with the weight because I think we packed light considering and I'm taking the underskirts for the bride as well. So I had quite a few things in my bag, but I think we've done good. We're just waiting to go to the airplane. It's okay. Hi, we're about to get on the airplane now. Say hi, mommy. Don't say hi, mommy. Say hi. <laughs> hi, mommy. <laughs> and yeah, we're about to get on now. My faith is strong. I'm getting stronger. While I'm waiting. Okay, bye. They're checking my passport now. Gotta go. Uh. We're on the airplane. I'm gonna say hi. <laughs> so, about to take off now. Have to switch out my phone. And thank you for watching. Don't forget to subscribe. Bye. Okay, according to UK time, it's like midnight now. We've just gone past midnight. And we're about to land in Washington. And all this time I thought it was pronounced as duels, but it's actually Washington Dulles, as my friend told me yesterday. Um, but yeah, we're nearly there and we're excited. <laughs>